A multi-agency drill getting first responders prepared for emergencies at Port Miami. South Florida police and firefighters teaming up with the U.S. military for the training operation. Their focus, hazardous materials. A Miami-Dade fire rescue helicopter hovers overhead. First responders wearing specialized protective gear repel onto a shipping container to deal with a chemical spill. But this is not an emergency. It's a multi-agency drill aimed at preparing police, firefighters, and the U.S. military to respond to a real emergency. Under a large scenario such as this, we would be working together possibly for days, if not weeks, if the scenario called for it. So it's important for us to have our movement coordinated, and this is what this helps do. In this scenario, a large shipping container has arrived at the port, leaking hazardous materials into the bay. Fire rescue boats also taking part in the training exercise with a camera drone capturing it all from above. Officials say it's a routine operation, planning for the unexpected. These type of drills happen throughout the year, but in different scales. This is a larger scale drill. We do smaller scale drills with uh, the military CST units at least two, three times a year. The ultimate goal, to keep South Floridians safe. You know, in, in our community's times of need, we can provide that support uh, in a timely fashion uh, so that we get that aid to the people who need it the most fastest. Officials spent the rest of the day performing several tactical tests centered around chemical detection and containment.